Hello and welcome back everyone, today we will look back at the 1993 American TV series Frasier. We will revisit the cast of the TV series and will find out what happened to them. I will also tell you some interesting trivia facts about the show which you probably did not know, so let's jump right into it. David Hyde Pierce, born April 3, 1959, is a versatile American actor renowned for his role as Dr. Niles Crane in Frasier. With four Emmy Awards, he captivated audiences with his neurotic portrayal. Pierce's talents extended to theater, winning a Tony Award for his role in Curtains. He has appeared in notable films and lent his voice to animated characters. Pierce is also an advocate for Alzheimer's research, actively involved in fundraising. A master of his craft, David Hyde Pierce has left an indelible mark on the industry. Perry Gilpin is an American actress known for her role as Ross Doyle in Frasier. Her portrayal of the sassy producer earned her critical acclaim and award nominations. Gilpin is also an advocate for animal rights and supporter of charities. She continues to inspire others with her work in the entertainment industry. Laura Linney is an American actress who has appeared in numerous films, television shows, and stage productions throughout her career. She is known for her versatile acting ability and has received critical acclaim and award nominations for her performances. Linney's breakout role on film came in 1993 with the movie Searching for Bobby Fischer. In addition to her acting work, Linny is also an advocate for social and environmental causes, and she has served as a board member for several organizations, including the World Wildlife Fund and the City Parks Foundation. Kelsey Grammer is an American actor best known for his roles in Cheers and Frasier. He has won multiple Emmys for his performances and has also worked as a producer and director. Despite personal challenges, he remains a respected and beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Kelsey's legacy as a performer is sure to endure for years to come. At the end of the show, Moose, the dog, was already a 14-year-old with white fur and almost deaf. Nonetheless, his trainer brought him on stage during the last episode's recording for one final bow with the cast. David Hyde Pierce described it as an emotional moment, witnessing Moose acknowledge and respond to the audience's applause for the last time. Aaron Eckhart is a versatile American actor known for his impressive performances in film and television. His breakout role was in Aaron Brockovich, 2000, and he gained critical acclaim for Thank You for Smoking, 2005. Eckhart is also a writer and producer, having written the screenplay for The Rum Diary, 2011, and produced and starred in I, Frankenstein, 2014. He is praised for his dedication to his craft and philanthropic work with the art of Elysium. Aaron Eckhart continues to be a respected and in-demand actor in the entertainment industry. Woody Harrelson is a versatile American actor known for his roles in Cheers, The Hunger Games, and Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. He's an activist for environmental and social causes, and is known for his laid-back demeanor and quirky sense of humor. Harrelson is also a writer and director, having written a play and a book, and directed the 2017 film Lost in London. He's made a significant impact on the entertainment industry and beyond. Felicity Huffman is an American actress known for her performances in film, television, and theater. She has won awards for her work, including a Primetime Emmy and a Golden Globe. Huffman was involved in a college admissions scandal in 2019, for which she pleaded guilty and was sentenced to prison, community service, and a fine. Despite this, she has continued to work in the industry, starring in TV series such as The Truth About the Harry K. Bird Affair and supporting charities. Moose is a Canadian actor known for his roles in Ace Ventura, When Nature Calls and Art School Confidential. He started as a stuntman in films like Lethal Weapon 4 and Starship Troopers. Moose has a unique look and physicality, often cast in roles as bouncers and thugs. He is also a martial artist and personal trainer. 
Despite his success, Moose remains grounded and committed to his craft. Requisite disrespect was the acting technique used by Kelsey Grammer, which involved rehearsing a scene just once and not learning his lines until just before the shoot. This approach brought energy and authenticity to his performance, according to Grammer. Although the cast and crew adapted to this method, guest stars were not fond of it. Jean Smart is an American actress known for her versatile performances in both comedic and dramatic roles. She gained recognition for her role in Designing Women and went on to star in Frasier and Samantha Who. She won an Emmy for her role in Watchmen and received critical acclaim for her role in Hacks. Smart remains grateful for her extraordinary career. Dan Butler is an American actor known for his dynamic performances on both stage and screen. Best known for his role as Bob Bulldog Briscoe in Frasier, he has also appeared in numerous films and TV shows. Butler has also written and directed several projects. He is an outspoken advocate for LGBTQ rights and has worked to promote acceptance and understanding. Dan Butler's talent and passion for acting have made him a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Tom McGowan is a versatile American actor known for his work on stage and screen. He's best recognized for his role as Kenny Daly on Frasier and has also appeared on shows like The Practice, The West Wing, and Desperate Housewives. McGowan has performed in Broadway productions like Wicked and Chicago, as well as off-Broadway shows, earning critical acclaim. He's won an Obie Award and has been nominated for several Drama Desk Awards for his theater performances. McGowan is also a voice actor, having lent his voice to animated series such as The Adventures of Puss in Boots. Amy Brenneman is a versatile American actress known for her roles in television and film. She gained recognition for her work in NYPD Blue and co-created and starred in Judging Amy. Brenneman brings depth and authenticity to her characters and is also an activist for women's rights and reproductive freedom. Her dedication to her craft and activism serve as an inspiration. David Hyde Pierce, known for his role in a famous series, has revealed that he wasn't particularly interested in wine or opera before joining the cast. Interestingly, it was John Mahoney, who played Martin Crane, a character who dislikes anything cultured, that introduced him to both. This is an ironic twist of fate. Terry Hatcher is an American actress known for her roles in Lois and Clark and Desperate Housewives. She has also appeared in films and is a writer and philanthropist. Despite personal challenges, Hatcher remains a resilient and inspiring figure. Edward Hibbert is a British actor known for his roles in theater, film, and TV. He made his Broadway debut in Me and My Girl and starred in productions like Crazy For You. He's also known for his role in Frasier as Gil Chesterton. Hibbert has written plays and a book, and he's an advocate for LGBT rights. Zoe Deschanel is a charming actress and musician, known for her quirky persona. She gained recognition for roles in Almost Famous and 500 Days of Summer. She's had success in TV and film, including New Girl and Elf. Deschanel formed the duo She and Him and released multiple albums. Her unique style and personality make her a favorite among fans and critics. She's a beloved figure in entertainment and will continue to inspire audiences. Ted Danson is an American actor known for his roles in Cheers, CSI, and The Good Place. He has won two Golden Globe Awards and been nominated for an Emmy. Danson is also an environmental activist, serving on the board of Oceana. He is a respected figure both on and off screen. With 37 Emmy wins, this television series held the record for the most Emmy wins for any TV show until 2016, when Game of Thrones won its 38th Emmy. Nonetheless, this show still holds the record for most Emmy wins for a comedy series. Christine Baranski is a versatile American actress known for her roles on stage and screen. Her breakout role came in the 80s in the TV series Cybill. 
She's also known for her iconic role in the musical comedy Mamma Mia! and its sequel. Baranski has had a successful career on stage as well. She's a vocal advocate for women in the entertainment industry and an inspiration to aspiring actors. With her impressive range and magnetic personality, Baranski has captivated audiences for decades. John Mahoney was a British-American actor best known for his role as Martin Crane on Frasier. He was a talented character actor who appeared in numerous films and TV shows throughout his career, earning critical acclaim and two Emmy nominations for his performance on Frasier. Mahoney was known for his warm personality and generosity towards his fellow actors. He passed away in 2018, leaving behind a legacy of memorable performances. Jane Leaves is an English actress known for her role as Daphne Moon on Frasier. She received critical acclaim for the portrayal of the warm-hearted character, earning Emmy and Golden Globe nominations. Leaves continued to act in shows like Desperate Housewives and Hot in Cleveland. She has also been an advocate for various charities. Leaves remains down-to-earth and dedicated to her craft. Perry Gilpin and Lisa Kudrow were the two contenders for the role of Roz. Initially, Kudrow's line delivery was deemed funnier and she was chosen. However, the show's creators found her lacking the necessary assertiveness for the character during rehearsals, and she was subsequently replaced by Gilpin.